mates and welcome back to a brand new video. So inside this video, I'll be making a pirate ship using a new pirate house. And without further ado, let's our grind to the video. I just instantly regret saying that, but you know what? I'm not going to re-record it because I think it's funny. <laughs> But anyways, now I'm going to start on making the build and first I'm going to clear out everything that is like in this area and I'm not going to delete them because I feel like they're quite expensive and I might actually need them so I'm going to move them to the side first and so when I need them I'm going to just like try to use as much items from the house already so this way I don't have to buy and spend my money. So I'm going to first start on making the kitchen and for the kitchen I'm going to do a different shape that I've never posted in my videos before. I've actually done it in like a recording footage I've never posted yet. So I'm going to do it here as well. And for the kitchen it's kind of like I guess a triangle shape. I'm not really sure how to explain it but you guys will see when I finish it. And also the colors I'm going to be mainly focusing on for this video are red, white, brown, black, blue, and some yellow. Also, I'm going to use some ramps for the simple shape as the oven hood. I feel like these looks a lot realistic than the ones that they already have. And as I said, it's going to be a triangle shaped kitchen, so I'm going to make the island counter very different this time.
we're making the kitchen, now I'm going to move on to the living room where like a chatting and resting area. And inside this place, I'm going to make a custom fireplace and also using a bunch of magic furnitures. Feels like the pirates should have like a room that's filled with books and also with like maps in them. So I'm going to make this room into like a library but also office and also like a place where you can like look for maps around the world.
so in the room next to the library slash office, I'm going to make it into a storage room which have like foods, a treasure, and anything that pirates have in it. And now we can finally move upstairs and I have some very nice plans for the rooms upstairs. So for the first room to your left, I'm going to make it into like a discussion room and it's kind of like a place where all the pirates can discuss which adventures they should go on next and also how do they split the treasure. So it took me quite a long time to think whether I should make a bathroom or not because I've never been a pirate before, I hope that's obvious. So I have no idea where they go to the bathroom. So just so that we don't pollute the ocean, I'm going to make a bathroom in this house. And I did cut off the part which I made the bathroom because it's like a very simple and normal bathroom so I feel like there is no need to show it. Now we're gonna move on to the captain's room. That arc did not work really well because I feel like my voice is like very high pitched and does not work for pirates. So just pretend that I was trying to be funny, okay? But anyways, for the captain's room, I kept the bed that they gave me because I feel like I really like it. And I also added some fireplace, a sitting area, a rug, and a window with some curtains.
last room in this house, I'm going to make it a room for the crew. Where is it even called a crew for pirates? But anyways, you guys get what I mean. So I'm just going to place down a bunch of beds inside one room and yeah. And lastly, I'm going to add a throne at the very end of the hallway with some barrels and crates next to it. And now we're done with the build, it is time for a tour.
thank you so much for watching. And if you like the video, please leave a like. And also subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you guys next time.